What's up, y'all? This is Pastor T. I'm talking, coming to you with the truth. And just remember that it is the truth that'll make you free. All right, y'all, this is all I want to tell y'all this morning. This is a beautiful Sunday morning. Um, although in spite of the rain and the cold, this is still a day that God has made, and we ought to rejoice and be glad in it. Amen? Amen. If I had to choose a topic, my topic would be this morning. Praise Him all the time. Check this out. Praise Him all the time. Y'all check this out. Yesterday was such a beautiful day. I don't know about nobody else. I was out yesterday and uh, the sun was shining and it was, it was shining so good and so pretty. Y'all, I went and got, got, you know, got my car, got my cars and went and got them washed and, you know, get ready, you know, get ready to go to church this morning. You know what I'm saying? And then when I got up this morning, I, I seen the news was saying that the rain was coming and whatnot, but I don't know, I was just one focus on that. And um, I got up this morning and it was it was so cold and raining. And you know what came to my mind was, thank you, Lord. What came to my mind was, God, I praise you anyway. God, thank you anyway. You know what I'm saying? Because so many times, y'all, we, we praise him when the sun is out. And I'm talking about spiritually. When the sun is out and everything going okay, everything going well, uh, the, the, the weather is beautiful, everything going the way you want it to go. And it's so easy for us to say, thank you, Lord. But then when the, when the rain comes, when, when the storm comes, when the clouds come, that's when we say, oh man, some of us, if we ain't really no, no, no worshipers or, or dedicated to praising God, We'll, we'll find that opportunity to be like, oh man, oh they're raining, oh man, I don't feel, I ain't going nowhere today, or, 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 or some storm coming in your life, you'll be like, oh man, oh man, what is going on, you'll begin to complain, but no, praise God all the time, do you hear me, y'all, I'm just saying, this morning, as I was on my way, I'm, I'm, I'm on my way to church now, and right in front of me, just happened, a bad accident just happened right in front of me. You know what I'm saying? And I just, and I was just praising God. Me and my family on the way to church, and we were just in here worshiping, praising God. And I was, I was, I was recording one of, I was recording a video, and and all of a sudden, this car just began to hydroplane right in front of me. But you know what God showed me? See, that could have been me. That could have been us. But because I was worshiping and praising God, thanking him, I wasn't thinking about no car. I just got my car washed yesterday. So what? You know what I'm saying? What about what about a car? Let's go. Let's ride. We're going to worship the Lord. I don't care about no rain. You know what I'm saying? That's my mindset. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to praise you anyway. You know what I mean? I'm going to give him the honor and praise anyway. Because why? I'm an all-time praiser. And I praise God all the time. So I'm challenging y'all out there today. I don't care what's going on in your life. I don't care what's going on around you. Always give God the praise. Situation may not be the way the, the way you ideally want them, but still give God His praise. Do you hear me? Do y'all hear me? Let me give y'all a scripture to back. This is one of my old familiar scriptures. I don't use this a hundred times, but I, I but it's so fitting for this morning. Psalm thirty-four and one says, "I will bless the Lord." at all times. His praise shall continually be in my mouth. God is looking for some all-time praise. Some folk that's willing to praise him anyway. Some folk that's willing to praise him in the midst of the storm. Some folk that's willing to praise him when the rain is going. Folk that's willing to praise him when the sun is out and when the sun ain't out. You still willing to praise the Lord. And God desires that type of worshiper. That's why he told the woman at the. That's why he told the woman at the well. He said, he, he said those who worship him must worship him in the spirit and in truth. Other word, what I'm saying, y'all, don't let your situation and your your circumstances dictate your praise. Regardless of what's going on in your life, give God the honor and praise, and watch what God do. You hear me? Do, you, do y'all hear me? Do you feel me? Let me give you the scripture again. Psalm 34 and 1, it said, 
I will bless the Lord at all times. His praise shall continue to be in my mouth. This morning, y'all, give God praise all the time. Do y'all hear me? Do you feel me? All right. This is Pastor T.R. Thompson coming to you with the truth. And just remember that it is the truth that'll make you free. All right, y'all. Thumbs up. Peace out.